Channel 9 Midday is next. Fire has claimed a life at an apartment complex in Chattanooga. And fire investigators are now trying to figure out what started this fire that has also left several families homeless. I'm John Pless. We'll have an update live on News Channel 9 Midday. Good afternoon. Thanks for joining us. A man has died in a fire that raced through the Montclair Apartments in Chattanooga on Mountain Creek Road. News Channel 9 was first on the scene of the fire when it broke out at 7 this morning. News Channel 9's John Pless is there now with the latest. Have firefighters identified the victim yet, John? Bob, investigators have not released the name of the victim just yet, but I can tell you his family members are here on site, and they're just absolutely devastated about what has happened. But... The victim's father, we're told, did make it out of the apartment they were both sharing alive. People who live in the Montclair apartments wake to the sound, the smell, and the sight of an out-of-control fire. The first firefighters to arrive call for backup because the flames are racing toward neighboring units. It sounded like a big sonic boom, and it shook the whole house, and didn't really think anything of it first, and then you heard all the sirens come in. Firefighters' first concern is getting everyone out alive. Neighbors begin the rescue effort before fire engines get on the scene. My, the boys went down there and tried to open, you know, tried to wake everybody up, and that opened the doors and tried to kick on the doors to get the people up. They kind of had a hard time getting some of them up. Within an hour, the fire is under control, but there are plenty of hot spots that will take time to cool. The fire had the potential of getting out of hand and consuming some of the other units here in this complex, but firefighters went next door and took aggressive action. In terms of going into uh, units ahead of where the fire was, apartment units, um, going upstairs and pulling the ceiling out, um, and then basically heading off the fire before it could go any further. Firefighters taking care of remaining hot spots confirm neighbors' worst fears. They find the body of a man who lived in the apartment where the fire started. I'm, my heart just goes out to the family. I know they're really upset about it and everything, and it's just it's sad for them, and just hope that they get through it okay. And again, that family is just absolutely devastated, but they're not the only ones grieving over this loss. There are four to six families who lived here as well. And we're told the Red Cross is working with them right now, trying to find some temporary shelter, perhaps something to eat, some clothes, just to get through this tragedy. We'll have a full update on the situation in a team report live from the location beginning on News Channel 9 at 5. We'll see you then. Reporting live from the Montclair Apartments, I'm John Pless, News Channel 9. Bob? All right, thanks for that, John.